Welcome to DIY is my happy place. I'm Amy and today I'm going to give you a brilliant idea for Christmas gifts. Now I know Christmas can be tricky and oh boy do I have some great ideas that'll, well let's just say they're not going to wear you out. Won't take a lot of time and <laughs> it'll help you to be able to spread some Christmas cheer to someone in your life. Now, I don't know about you, but I know many of us get gift anxiety when we're trying to plan what type of gifts to give and really trying to figure it out without breaking the bank. You don't want it to be lame, but you don't want to break the bank. And I don't know about you, but holiday shopping can be stressful in and of itself. Going to the right store, going to the right, trying to get here, trying to get there, the hustle and bustle. Oh, man, are you feeling anxiety as I do sometimes? Well, this DIY is going to show you how you can create some really fun, creative gift ideas from your local Dollar Tree. Why not, I say? Because it's fun, exciting, and creative. Let me show you. Now, before we talk about what the actual gift is, I do want to bring up one little thing that has worked very well for me for any kind of gift exchange, no matter who I'm giving it to. And that is to remember to spend some time making the wrapping, the packaging, how you present the gift, beautiful. And I'll say this, the majority of people around do not ever think about walking into a Dollar Tree. So what's inside the gift? <laughs> Most people won't even know it came from the Dollar Tree. And if they do know that it came from the Dollar Tree, then they're one of us. And they'll understand that, hey, being frugal is smart. So while you're in the Dollar Tree, pick up a few little bells or pine cones or ribbon, whatever. Just knowing that you can jazz things up by being a little bit creative on the packaging and cutting a few little sprigs off a tree or off your Christmas tree or wreath goes a long way. The other fast option is the fun little boxes that you can get from the Dollar Tree. They're, they come in all shapes and sizes. They look so decorative. Now, what would you put in these boxes, you might ask? Well, that kind of depends on who you're buying for. I always feel like in the winter, everyone could use a new pair of soft gloves. Male, female, child, adult, grandma, grandpa, doesn't matter a pair of snuggly gloves to put so you don't have to hold on to a cold steering wheel, always a hit. The other thing that's always a hit is a nice pair of snuggly soft socks. This is amazing. All the different types that you can get from the Dollar Tree and you can even find a more masculine version if you don't like these Christmas socks for your male friends, but I'm telling you, there's a lot of versions. There's a lot of different styles at Dollar Tree. Another fun option is some aviator sunglasses. These are so back in style right now. <laughs> they cost a fortune, but mm, not when you get them from the Dollar Tree. Again, this could be for male or female or children. Really, who doesn't like a pair of sunglasses? <laughs> I love it. Again, just because we're on a tight budget doesn't mean that we can't be a little creative, have a little bit of fun, and come up with something for all walks of life from your local Dollar Tree. And don't worry, we're just getting started. There's more ideas where that came from. Why don't you consider for your gift exchange. If you go in the kitchen section, there's some lovely tea towels that are just really a lot of fun. Who doesn't need some gnome tea towels, I ask you? I think everybody. Or, you know, oven mitts, a uh, hot pad. They're cute. And again, you buy these tea towels or a cute little gnome sign, whatever, and then just make sure you wrap them up, make them look fancy, and Boy, it'll be great. Now I want to talk about a real fast and easy way to create a sort of a craft gift, treat, what have you. But the best part about this treat, no baking needed. <laughs> Let me show you. 
go to the Christmas candy section in the Dollar Tree and you'll find a lot of things that will work splendidly for this little craft. You will need two M&M candy cane containers for each one of these crafts and then three or four box candies. Add some hot glue to the boxes to attach them all together and voila, you have a fun sleigh. Who doesn't want a fun candy cane sleigh? I mean, isn't this great? Using the same idea, you can do different variations. You could wrap the candy in wrapping paper and then add a scent, chocolate Santa to it. Or if you wanted to, you could wrap the box sled part with a pair of gloves with the box that we talked about earlier. And so inside, instead of treats, they get gloves or a tea towel or any other idea that we came up with. The best part is your gift exchange does not have to stress you out. These same ideas can be used for a white elephant gift, gifts for him. I've had a lot of questions about, I don't know what to do. I have to get a male gift. What should I give? Dollar tree and fancy packaging. I'm telling you, it works. Many people say, what about for teacher gifts? That's always confusing. Again, same thing. Or for a gift to give to all your neighbors who doesn't love a little Santa's sleigh full of treats. Santa's Christmas sleigh is a welcome gift in any household for any walk of life because who doesn't love to be remembered during the holiday season it's just nice to be able to give something and show that you're thinking of them. Oh, hey, I interrupt this uh, message so that I wanted to remind you, don't forget to subscribe. All right, let's keep going. So hop on over to your local Dollar Tree, pick up a few basic supplies, and spread the joy at the wonderful holiday season. And I will see you again soon. See ya.